For our jet airplane, we'll be using three balloons. We've got a diamond clear that I've only inflated about seven or eight inches. We won't need all of that. I've got two Batalitex 260 Fashion Royal Blues. One is inflated, leaving about a two inch tail on the end. That will be for our wings. The other has about a five inch tail. We're going to start with this one. And I've trimmed the nozzle fairly close to keep it clean on the end. Make about a one and a half inch bubble. And we're going to make about a half inch bubble. Make that into a pinch twist. Another half inch bubble. Make that into a pinch twist as well. So we now have two pinch twists opposite each other there. Now we're going to make about a three inch bubble. And again, another half inch bubble. Make that into a pinch twist. Another half inch level. Make that into a pinch twist as well. So we've got an inch and a half bubble, two pinch twists, about a two and a half to three inch bubble, two more pinch twists. Now we're going to come back along with another bubble the same size as this one. So lay it alongside there, measure it out, and then twist into those first two pinch twists. And then again, lay it alongside it so that we can match it again and twist it into the back two pinch twist. So we now have three bubbles there in the middle. Now it's left over. Twist about an inch and a half bubble, a little half inch bubble, make that into an ear twist. And what's left will become our tail vertical stabilizer. Twist it out almost to the end so it's nice and soft. Twist the bubble on the end there. Bring that down into the middle and twist it around. And this little fold twist that you have left here, twist that into two smaller fold twists to make the tail. Now you want to take and position it so you've got your tail back here. And then for your three bubbles, you've got the two on top and the extra bubble on the bottom. And then your two ear twists are lined up like that. We're going to take our other 260 blue, come into the front here, twist it into the first two ear twists. Now we're going to go out and make about a seven or eight inch bubble. And you've got a couple of choices here. Depending on what kind of wing you make, we can make a delta wing, or if you take and twist and just come straight back like that to get a jet fighter. Or, I'm going to make a slightly different wing. We're going to make about a one inch bubble out on the end here. And then I'll make the second bubble slightly shorter than that one. Twist that into those back two ear twists. So we get a wing like that. That wing can be however you like it to be. Now to make sure I get my wings the same size, I'll bring that other over. And just lay it alongside and measure to ensure that both wings are even. Twist that piece back up in there. Remove any excess and secure the loose end. And then position your wings on opposite sides of your airplane. And these ear twists that we have will help hold them out flat. So we've got our two wings like that. Now again, you want to have the extra bubble on the bottom. So your tail is sticking up the opposite of that third, so you've got this flat surface here on top. Now we're going to take our diamond clear, and we're going to twist it in at the back of the wings here. Twist it around once or twice to secure it. Sometimes you'll lose an ear twist there. If you do, don't worry about it. That's twisted in pretty securely. What I'll do is I'll make a little small half inch bubble with this diamond clear. Make that into an ear twist to replace the bubble that just popped. Now you're going to take your diamond clear, lay it across the top for your canopy. Twist it, a bubble the same size as those, and then twist that into those front two ear twists. Pop the excess off. Twist that up into there. We've got a little jet airplane, and if you want, you can add a little canopy artwork here. And we've got a little jet airplane.